Hello, and welcome back to Cracking the Cryptic. Um, we've not done a crossword for a while, so uh, we should really. Uh, so I'm going to try today's Times crossword, and I'll try and talk through what I'm thinking as we go through the solve. Uh, had spiced up editorial content. Okay, the key to solving this clue is the word content or content. Uh, it's hinting at the fact that we might be able to find the answer as the content of the previous words. So if we look within the words spiced up and editorial, we can see in order D-U-P-E-D, -E duped. And if you have someone, you dupe them. So past tense gives us the answer. Let's try and use the letters. Men on board, I'm thinking drafts. So I'm thinking draftsmanship here, I read the clue. Uh, provide crew, well, that would be man. Uh, scaling. Oh, I don't know if I spell it correctly. Um, drafts moon. Scaling. Why scaling ship? Maybe it's not ship, it's draftsman. I'm not sure. Let's come back to that. Uh, Self-righteous, liberal, short of company. Self-righteous, proud. Liberal, short of company. Well, company is very often co, C-O. So, ah, pious, copious. If we take co out of copious, which means liberal, we get a word which means self-righteous. Now, Experienced solvers may struggle a bit with that clue because liberal is very often abbreviated to L there. Now if you start trying to start putting an L in the answer somehow, you'll get stuck. Now, maybe not as easy as it looks there. 11 across. Rabbit, lover, to give back trap. Well, rabbit might, if you rabbit, you talk. Gas is a word for talk, so I'm wondering about that. Lover to give back. Trap. I'm not sure. Uh, one will defend apologist, perhaps a point after game. Okay, well, A here. This word, this letter A, is actually that A. In terms of wordplay, the point of something is the gist of it, and a game. We put the gist after a word for a game, or polo is a game. An apologist is one who will defend. 3D depiction of moon in play. A 3D depiction, I mean, I'm lucky here. I know the word diorama as a 3D depiction. So it's simply a case, if you know that word, of trying to fit that into the, into the word play. Now, there's a couple of interesting things I'll mention here. This, the moon here is Io, which is, I think, a moon of Jupiter, but I may be wrong about that. It's a, one of the planetary moons in the solar system. Uh, a play is a drama. So we've got moon in play to give diorama. Now, the interesting word here, I think, is the word of, which is being used as a link between the definition, which is 3D depiction, and the word play, which is moon in play. Now, of is a link word. Uh, I don't mind it too much, but some people do mind it. They, they would prefer the word something from in there, 3D depiction from the moon in play. Um, but, uh, you know, that's one that the purists might debate a little. Pirate's card game. Okay, well, we're probably looking for the name of a card game here. Now, there are a lot of them. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I'm not coming up with one immediately, so let's go to four across. Colourful. Night leaves full of love after church. Well, I'm wondering about something like, yes, cro chromatic. Church is almost always either abbreviated CH, which is just a shortened form of church, or CE for Church of England. So I see the words after church here, and I'm immediately thinking that this might begin like this. Colourful, well, chromatic means colourful. And knight, well, knight in, in chess is abbreviated to N uh, into, if in chess notation. 
So we need to remove an N because night is leaving full of love. Well, if you're full of love, you're romantic. Take the N out, we get romantic. Put that on the end of the CH, and there we go. So, uh, pirates. If you pirate something, you copy it. Uh, Smee hook. Ah, card game. Having the brain moment there. A uh, royal attendance in turbulent rain acquiring new skills. Okay. Well, the word turbulent here is very suggestive to me of an anagram. So let's try and read the clue with that in mind. So turbulent rain, that looks like it. We need an anagram of rain, and we need to put royal attendance in the middle of an anagram of rain. Now not necessarily a word you might know, but you might be able to guess that a train, you know, that is a word for royal attendance. So if we put an anagram of rain around that, we get retraining, which means acquiring new skills. Catch badly. Miss here, perhaps? In marshy ground, conceding one run. Okay, yes. So you can see that the word marshy here has two R's in it. Run in cricket terms is very often abbreviated to R. So if Marcia concedes one of its R's, we would get seven letters. And ground here is not being used as in the sense that the clue might make it look, you know, it's not it's not looking at earth. Ground here is as in grind. It's the past tense of the word grind. If you grind something, you mix it. So that's the anagram indicator. If you catch something badly, as in you don't quite hear it, you don't quite catch it, you miss here. Gunners waving flag held by sailor in battle. Trafalgar, maybe? Yes, OK, it is that. And there's a few bits of crossword ease to understand why it's Trafalgar. So let me put it in and then we can explain it. So gunners, that's the Royal Artillery, RA, a waving flag, or well, waving here is being used as an anagram indicator. It's saying anagram, the word flag. And you can see F-A-L-G there in the middle. So we've got RA and an anagram of flag held by sailor. Well, tar, T-A-R, as in all the nice girls love a sailor, all the nice girls love a tar. It's an old word for a sailor put the whole thing together we get Trafalgar which is a very famous battle so that's probably the easiest way of getting that answer. Levy for which Brussels possibly gets blame. Oh that's going to be some sort of how about capital gains tax that would fit. That's certainly a levy. Bus Brussels pro possibly well Brussels is an example of a capital. Gets if you get something you gain it and blame if you blame you tax. So capital gains tax, I think, is the answer. Rogue. Well, looking at these letters, we should immediately be thinking of scamp. And you can see ultimately splits is saying take the ultimate letter of the word splits. That's this S here. And then we need a four-letter word for a faction. Well, that's a camp put it together we get the answer so I'm rather worried here I've got all the letters for both 11 across and 4 down and I haven't got the answers yet uh, get engaged to escort then split up get engaged to escort then split up <coughs> to escort is to date to, to split up is to part so I'm, I'm sort of playing with these words in my mind to try and Get engaged to. Uh, hmm, no, I don't know. Fit for a king, so this is going to be regal. Beer from the east. Okay, well, from the east is a piece of classic crossword ease. Again, it just means reverse the answer because if you, you know, if you make the rather than running left to right, from the east is implying right to left. So reverse lager, you get regal. Islander, okay, so Tasmanian. From a small island, one with brown skin. A, okay, so 
Okay, let's have a look. Uh, from a small island. Okay, here we've got S for small, I think. Man, as in the Isle of Man. Uh, one is this one here. In fact, this A is this A. So this is very convoluted. It's, it's, it's this little A here is this A. Followed by S for small. Followed by man for island. Followed by I for one. And that's all with a brown skin, so with tan, which means brown around the outside. And the whole thing is another islander, which is Tasmanian. Uh, sorry, put this one. Noddy's lack of memory recalled. Ooh. Whenever I see memory, I'm always thinking of ROM and RAM as in computer memory. Uh, Noddy's lack of memory. Ah, a noddy is a moron. And if you have no ROM, so what I was right to think of computer memory, uh, you can reverse that and you get moron. So no ROM reverse there. Odd American dance succeeding twist. Oh, how about something like screwball or something like that? So a dance is a ball. A twist is a screw, and odd American, I think, is saying this is an American word for, for odd. Something screwball across the Atlantic, it would be odd. So I think that's the answer. 21 across. When most events occur, maybe in Big Brother's terms. Newspeak? Big Brother's terms? Certainly the language of Big Brother. When most events occur, maybe, at a news peak. <laughs> a peak in the news would be when most events occur, is, is what's being got at there. It's a cryptic definition. Uh, 18 down. Sweep up last of slush. That briefly forms solvent. Something like naphtha. Yeah, okay. Sweep up is a reversal of the word pan, followed by the last of slush. The last letter of the word slush is H. That briefly is a brief form of the word that, i.e. take the last letter off the word that. The whole thing, naphtha, is a type of solvent. So, compassion from judge at start of trial Okay, if you judge, you hear. The start of the word trial is a T. That gives heart, which is compassion. So this does look like draftsmanship then. So she... Oh, scaling craft. I was... Oh. Red on the board. A scaling craft. Is draftsmanship, isn't it? Maybe. Men on board. Quite seeing how the wordplay works there. Uh, college with vacant ref refectory taking on several partners. P polygamous or something like that? Or polyamorous? Well, college is going to be poly. Refractory vacant is going to be to just take the outside letters of the word refectory, so get rid of the, vacate the inner bits of that. Um, that gives us our why. So polyamory, is that going to be the answer? Taking on several partners. Or polyandry. I, wonder, I think with here is going to be and. So I think polyandry can mean taking on several partners. 
like autocrat on a trip passed over. Like autocrat on a trip. If you're on a trip, you're high. An autocrat would be high-handed. Passed over, you hand something to something, you pass it to them. So high-handed is like an autocrat. Voluntary payments. Honoraria. This is a weird crossword word. I've seen before. So I think this is a word that means uh, it's, a, it's tips. Uh, are honoraria. Uh, or tribute in US, a strain on reflection. Uh, a strain on reflection. Okay, well, strain on reflection is going to be... Yes, okay, so a tribute in the US is an honour without the U. So the American spelling of tribute. Uh, a is this A here, this, and then strain on reflection is a reversal of the word air, as in a musical strain, uh, and that gives us the whole thing. So a, a very difficult word, and not easy to really to get that from the wordplay if you don't know that it's a word. Vexed if ordered to throttle labour leader. Uh, Well, Labour leader is going to be L. It's not going to be anything to do with Jeremy Corbyn. Uh, so I, I think this is going to mean vexed. I think it's going to be a word for ordered around an L. So I, I was thinking of rattled, um, but ratted for ordered doesn't seem quite right. So let's come back to that. Let's use this X. Retiring Times Editor, Henning Books, a turn off for addicts. Well, how about detox? That seems likely, doesn't it? Retiring times editor. Well, if we reverse times as in a times table, three times four or something, that would be symbolized by an X. Editor is ED. That's being reversed around OT there for books. OT is an abbreviation for Old Testament. So if you see books in a crossword clue, always be thinking of OT and NT, uh, Old and New Testament. Toboggan losing its rear part drifted off. Uh, a toboggan sledge sleigh losing its rear part drifted off, slept. Ah, I should be able to get that, Carl. Tramp's friend remained with daughter in custody. Tramp's friend. Oh, a lady in a tramp. So if you remained somewhere, you lay there. And then D for daughter is inside to give lady. I think that's how that's intended to work. Most tedious. Diet deals with disorder. Okay, well, diet deals is being disordered in this answer. Uh, and you can see it's sort of a comparative, so it's very likely to end like that. So if you can't quite do the anagram, as I'm struggling to do, um, is that the deadliest? Is that really most tedious? Uh, I think it probably is. It seems to fit with the anagram fodder gives us our L of rattled, which is probably not right, but 22 across. Colleges in functioning state, complete agreement. Colleges are unis. If you're, if something's in a functioning state, it's on. Put those together, we get unison. Okay, so vexed is going to be... Uh, well, it's not gruntled, as in PG Woodhouse, uh, and disgruntled. Um, if ordered, ranged, something ordered, it's a oh, rankled. Okay, you order something, you rank it. And rankled, of course, means vexed. Um, toboggan losing its rear. Oh, okay, well, sled, S L E D, is a word for toboggan. So let's remove the rear from that and add PT for a PT is a, a valid abbreviation for part there. 
drifted off its sled. So we're just left with these last three. Right, let's go back to this one. What's this? Gas bag. Um, gas bag. Rabbit lover. To give back. If you give, you sag, maybe. And a trap is a bag. So gas bag. A rabbit lover. Gosh, that's difficult. Um, somebody who enjoys talking is a gas bag. Uh, pirates. Card game. Crib. If you crib, if you copy something, you crib it. And crib and cribbage, uh, I think, is synonymous. synonymous. So get engaged to escort. To escort is to take, isn't it? So that might be useful. Get engaged, you take part if you get engaged and split up as parts. So there we go, I think that's the answer. Let's submit it and see if we get a green, a lot of green letters. And we have to wait for the internet to chug. There we go. So that's correct. I hope this was useful to those of you who are new to the Times crossword. Uh, I've gone through every clue there and tried to explain how I approached solving it. If you enjoy the channel, please do subscribe. We really appreciate that. And we'll be back soon with another edition of Cracking the Cryptic.